Hey, John Mark Griffin here. Just going to teach you a little bit about wine today. I'm always in the grocery stores and people are always wondering the differences between different varieties of wine. So I'm going to kind of break it down for you. What are the differences? Here we go. Pull a few bottles. Let's take a look. Champagne. It's going to be some of the rarest stuff in the world. It's going to have some sort of fruit to it. Crisp, beautiful, very rare. That's why it's expensive, but you're getting what you pay for. Prosecco, light, great for mimosas, hint of sweetness, but more refreshing bubbles than anything. Italian whites, some of the best food wine in the world. Sauvignon Blanc, grapefruit, crisp, gonna have that high citrusy food, fruit going on. Rosé, some of the best ones out there are the ones that have the floral hint, that are flat rosés, delicious, great choice for this weather we're having. Cabernet, gonna have that rich, bold fruit going on. Great with meat, red meat, uh, kind of a great meal wine. Pinot Noir, this is your drinking wine. This is your, you know, just got home from work. Want a nice, light body wine with some great fruit flavor. Merlots, people hate on Merlots, but Merlots, some of the Merlots out there are some of the best wines in the world. Great medium bodied fruit. Uh, fruit forward wines, but they're going to have that dark richness to them. Red blends. All different types of red blends out there, but some that are the best to just drink are the ones that are 10 to $15 and have that mixed berry fruit going on. Petite Syrah. Kind of like a cab. Deep bodied, deep rich fruit, but also going to have a different type of deepness to it. It's almost going to be peppery and have kind of a dry finish. And Italian reds. People, this is your red sauce wine. Get out there and make some spaghetti or some lasagna and open up a bottle of Frescobaldi. That's all I got, guys. Let me know what you think.